Mr. President, the Office of the High Commissioner for Human Rights is mandated with promoting and protecting the enjoyment and full realization by all people of all rights as established in the UN Charter and international human rights law. However, in its first ever report on Jammu and Kashmir, the esteemed office has altogether ignored the fact that China occupies more than 20% of my homeland. The gifting of the Shaksam Valley in 1963 to Beijing by another occupier, Pakistan, violating UN Security Council Resolution 47 and the criminal abrogation of the state subject rule in Gilgit, Baltistan in 1974 have also not been mentioned in this report. The former High Commissioner has not been attentive to what happened in 1963 or 1974, but surely the current High Commissioner must be aware that China is constructing the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor through Gilgit Baltistan, which historically and legally remains an inseparable part of the disputed territory of Jammu and Kashmir. Mr. President, the utter omission of the illegal construction of the CPAC, which is in contravention of international law, and the UN Security Council resolutions on Jammu and Kashmir, and the continuous exploitation of my land as collateral by Pakistan, while mortgaging the future of my people in order to defray its so-called all-weather friendship with China, have indebted the current High Commissioner to rectify the serious inaccuracies of this report, not only to validate the mandate of this office, but more so to re-establish the trust of the people of Jammu and Kashmir in this UN human rights body and its mechanisms.